so in 12 weeks remaining in 2022 12 weeks and it's very very important that you remain focused on fixing your weak areas which you are finding out from writing mock tests you remain focused on revising your chapters so that you are able to retain all the things which are written in 96 chapters in each syllabus now what is happening is a lot of students are looking at NTA Abhyas app and hoping that this is a cheat sheet which it is not right Aryan was telling me uh, he had conducted a poll on his telegram channel in which he had asked students why are you using NTA Abhyas app right what is the reason because it is free or it is from uh, from this questions will come in need 2022 and third thing was questions were good right this was the reason for more than 60 percent of the students they are hoping that when they are doing nta abhyas app when they are practicing mock tests from that because it is from nta nta is also going to make paper out of that god bless you right I'll tell you a story. When I was at IIT Delhi, there was a particular course I was doing along with a lot of students and we were not able to understand anything in that test. So one day before the exam, someone came to us and said, these are the 15 questions which are going to come in the test tomorrow. Good, we are not understanding anything. So we uh, prepared from it and went to the paper. As soon as the exam came, everyone looked at this guy who had given us the paper because none of the question was from the paper. Is that something which is going to happen to you in NEET exam? Whoever is hoping that NT Abhyas app would have all the questions of NEET 2022. I think the purpose of giving this app by NTA is, NTA is a testing agency and they want people to prepare, practice before they write the test that they are conducting. In this case, NEET 2022. So they have provided a free practice app they have not provided an app from which questions are necessarily going to come right so if you are practicing questions because you want to practice more good if you are practicing because it is a cheat sheet you are amazing you are amazing right for what purpose students are using it a lot of students 60 percent are using it for cheat sheet god bless you right now i want to tell you why do you practice mcqs and why do you practice mock tests you practice MCQs because NEET exam is about MCQs. You read the theory, you go through videos, then you should be able to apply it in multiple choice questions, right? Then it doesn't matter whether exactly the same question which you practice will come in NEET exam or not. Once you have practiced, once you have developed your concepts, good. That is good, right? You would be able to do well in the exam. Why do you practice mock test? Because you practice completing the paper in 3 hour 20 minutes. You revise before the mock test so, you, so that you don't forget. You will revise before the actual NEET exam also. You uh, get to know your weak areas, you are able to focus on your weak areas rather than going through the complete 96 chapters again and again. Guys, 12 weeks remain. 1 May, 8 May, 15 May, 22nd May, 29th May, 5 June, 12 June, 19 June, 26 June, 3rd July, 10 July and 17 July. Happy birthday. You will be born with a new identity. You would not be known only by your father's name. You would also be known by what you did to yourself. Which is you cracked a very very big exam in which 16 lakh participants write the exam. There are around 46, 47,000 government colleges. There might be more seats coming out of private colleges this year. So this is what you would have achieved. You are not going to the exam so that you have gone through some cheat sheet and you'll be able to do well in the paper. It won't happen. Don't waste your time practicing from NTA Abhyas app because you think it's a cheat sheet. You should practice NTA Abhyas app uh, if you want more practice. But remain focused guys. It is very very important that you remain disciplined in these remaining 12 weeks. Still a lot of time remaining. 12 weeks is 84 days. You can do a lot but remain focused, remain disciplined. And promise me in the comment section of the video, you're not going to treat anything as if exact questions are going to come in the exam. That is a bad mentality and that will lead to a lot of disappointment and frustration. Alright students.